welcome to another fantastic edition and episode of your number one favorite celebrity show with your number one celebrity host and guess who is the host the olamide of this tube tv you know that bad guy your mama warned you against that but that your favorite tv boy yeah it's celebrity facts on this tube tv with the olamide well a very big shout out to all our fans and viewers that have been subscribing to the channel thank you very much you all are the real mvp well at this period in time you know there is a pandemic going on everywhere in the whole world i just urge everybody to stay safe just make sure you keep to the precautions and keep yourself clean wash your hands every time make sure you don't get contaminated and you know just stay safe stay alive we love you all the way from gstube tv thank you back to the show celebrating facts with the alarmity of gstube tv you know how we do it on celebrity facts where we get to talk to you about one of the favorite celebrities be it an actor an actress a comedian a comedian a model just name it you know how we do it on this show we talked about the favorite actors the favorite actresses funka kindeli we talked about tony abraham we talked about several comedians we, we talked about musicians just name it, we've talked about two Baba and Jazzy. And today I'm gonna to be talking about someone who is, you know, a very handsome guy in the Nigerian movie industry. This guy is handsome. Like he's the lady's choice. He's a model, he's a TV presenter, he's an actor. He's just your favorite fine boy in the Nigerian music industry. I mean the Nigerian movie industry. Just name it. Who is the person? I'm not gonna be talking about that I've ever seen that. Your favorite award-winning actor, Timini Egbusen. Yeah, I'll be talking about Timini Egbusen today on the show. All you've got to know about Timini Egbusen, just name it. Just stay tuned, don't touch the dab. It's just Tube TV. The Olamide is the host. Now to Timini Egbusen. He was born in Lagos State, although he's from Bayosa State, with the name James Timini Egbusen. He was born on the 10th of June year what year 1987 just by the virtue of that just calculate it use your mathematics yeah he's 32 years he'll be 33 this June and you know this guy is doing real well in the Nigerian movie industry well today I'll be telling you about his academic background his family life everything you've got to know about Timini Egbusen I'm going to be telling you today like I said he was born James Timini Egbusen from Bayelsa State he was born on the 10th of June, 1987. He's 32 years. He'll be 33 this June. Yes. So now, let's go to his, what, his academic background. He attended Green Spring Montessori for his primary education in Lagos State. He also attended Adebayo Mukuolu College in Lagos State for his secondary school education. Before he gained admission into the University of Lagos, where he studied psychology. Yes, Timine Busan studied psychology in the University of Lagos where he graduated in the year 2011. Wow, Timine Busan graduated from the University of Lagos in the year 2011. He ventured into movies around 2010. Yeah, he ventured into movies around 2010 where he started as his elder sister's PA. His elder sister is Dakore Akonde Egbusan. Yeah, his elder sister is one of the favorite actresses. She's an award-winning actress. In the Nigerian movie industry, she's, you know, doing very fine in the Nigerian movie industry. And Timini Egbusan started as his sister's PA. You know, going on set with his elder sister. He was a PA for some years. Then in 2013, he came into limelight where he bagged a role in Mnet series, Tinsel. He got a role in Tinsel. And since then, Timini has been, you know, thriving in the Nigerian entertainment industry. He has been doing very fine in the Nigerian entertainment industry as a model, as a what? As a TV presenter, he hosts Red Carpet too. In 2017, he hosted GT Bank Fashion Week Red Carpet alongside Wu, his girlfriend in the Nigerian movie industry, Sharon Oja. In 2017, they both hosted the Red Carpet of GT Bank's Fashion Week. Well, it has been going around in the Nigerian entertainment industry, movie industry, Particularly that Timini Egbusan is in love with Sharon Oja. But in an interview, Timini Egbusan, you know, he debunked this rumor that they are just very good friends as they've been together on roles. When asked that, what's the favorite? What is this? You know, in the most interesting part of his work as an actor, Timini Egbusan said he has got the chance to kiss several beautiful actresses. Like wow, 
This guy could be funny, actually. Timile Busan could be funny, you know. At the same time, it could be serious. Yes. Like I said, Timile Busan is an award-winning actor. He has got no, he was nominated for a whole lot of awards in the Nigerian movie industry, and he has won a whole lot. Yes, in 2017, he was nominated for the City People Award as the best new act, the best new actor. But well, he could not win this category. But he came back bigger and better in 2020, where he won an award in AMVCA. Yeah, he won an award in AMVCA 2020, where he won the award of what? <laughs> the best male actor in a drama or series for his role in the movie Elevator Baby. Timini Egbosan got, got this, you know, award as the best, what the best male actor in his role in Baby Elevator Baby. Yeah. Likewise, like I said, Timini Egbosan has got a whole a role in a whole lot of movies. He has featured in a whole lot of movies. Just let me name a few. He has featured in Tinsel. He has featured in M MTV Sugar. He has featured in, you know, the viral movie Ajuaya. He featured in Elevator Baby. He featured in 50 alongside his elder sister, Dakore Akonde. Well, when he was asked that, you know, his relationship with his elder sister and his rose to fame in an interview, Timmy Egusen said, well, he has hustled for himself, although his sister has helped him a bit to, you know, stand on his own, but he has worked his way up himself, you know, to buy roles from in different movies. He said now he's not a brother to a superstar anymore. He's a superstar on his own, you know. Well, at the AMVCA 2020, where he got the award of the best male actor in a drama or TV series, this category was announced by his elder sister, Dakore Akonde. And, you know, just imagine the kind of anxiety and happiness that will be in his elder sister, Dakore Akonde, you know. Dakori was so, so excited to, you know, pronounce Timini Egbusan, our younger brother, as what? As the winner of the category of the best male actor in a drama or TV series. Wow. Timini has carved a name for himself, you know. He could be serious sometimes. Timini could be a funny character sometimes. This guy, I could describe this guy to be one of the versatile acts in the Nigerian movie industry. Well, Timini, a very big shout out and kudos to you for your part in the Nigerian movie industry, for you to have carved a name for yourself. You know, this guy is <laughs> pink. Well, like I said, let me just give you guys a recap into Timini's lifestyle and everything about him. Like I said, he was born on the 10th of June, year was year 1987. He had his primary, secondary, and university education in Lagos. He studied psychology in the University of Lagos. He is from Biosa State. His elder sister, Dakore Akonde, is also what a popular Nollywood actress. You know, she has featured in a whole lot of movies. She has produced a whole lot of movies. Like I said, Timine Busan hosted GC Banks Fashion Week 2017 alongside Sharon Hoja. Yes. Like I said, Timine Busan is an actor, is an is a model, is a TV presenter. Well, by now you all know about your favorite actor. Mini Egbusan. Well, yeah, I'll be dropping the curtain on what on Celebrity Facts on GSTV TV, which is number one celebrity host, the Olamide of GSTV TV. Like I do say, just you know, keep yourself clean during this period. And utmostly, if it's not important, don't go out. Stay safe. We love you from GSTV TV. Follow us on all social media at GSTV TV. Follow me personally on all social media at the Olamide underscore. Till next time, I love you all. Peace out.